Yeah. What's up? What's yeah. up? Y'all know what's going on, man. It's Bezo Bezo eight zero three all that social media. I got my co-host with me right now. Man, Mikey Dallas on Mikey, man. Look who we got back in the building. Sheesh. Sheesh, Gaudy Biggs, yes, aka no. Mr. Sheesh, you aka the Quiet Monster. I'm you know back in now. You know that. Salute, salute. Up, Big Motion up. Podcast exclusive interview. You know how we do it every time, man. We had to bring Gotti Biggs back. And, and Mike, you gotta, you gotta. If you don't like this name, I'm about to say, let me know. Because I was thinking on the way here, Go for it. certain guys like Gotti Biggs, a couple other people that and females that came multiple times, show love to the podcast. They was there from the beginning. We gotta call them like the Big Motion All Stars or something. Okay, okay, like, like I'm with it. That? The, yeah. Big Motion All Stars. Yeah. Just, and look, just, Gotti, don't, big. just don't make no list of that. Just don't yeah, ever yeah, put that yeah, in yeah, black yeah. and white, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you a big motion all star, man. Cause you done get him multiple okay. times along with others. So big shout out to everybody that yeah, yeah, yeah. been supporting us. Y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, boy, share this moment. with everybody you know. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss no drops. You know we drop multiple times every week. Ding. So you know what's going on, man. How you doing, right. brother? All is well, man. man. And they had a civilized talk. All yeah, is well, yeah, 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 yeah. All is well, man. <laughs> All is well. All is well. <laughs> man, it's good to see you, man. Likewise. Definitely. You know, you're putting a lot of work in out here, man. You know, the Mr. Hyde record is out right now. Going crazy. If you don't got that, go stream that. Save it. Run add it, up, it to your run playlist. It running up. Mr. Hyde, you know what's going on. That joint going crazy, man. Yeah. You know, we was down, at, we was down in... um. Augusta over the weekend for you know Paul Davis uh, music conference. Yeah, and, Paul uh, Davis. I let that Mister Hyde bang, and they was feeling that joint. Yeah. And you know who you know who ran up on me? Who? K Nine the God. That's my guy. My guy. K Nine the God was like, "Yo, who's that? I got <laughs> I got a link, y'all, man. Yeah, I think Please y'all. Do. I think y'all do some magic together because he was like, he was like, yo, 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 who, who's that? That joint was banging." Hey, yeah, that, that'd man, be I a, good, that. a real yeah. good connect right there. Yeah, like yeah, that. yeah, like, definitely. Yeah. I, I can see y'all doing something together, man. So big shout K9 big to shout God. K9. This it's the so homie right love. here. God, he's big. Yeah, and yeah, he's, the, he's the guy that got the Mr. Hyde record. So we're going to link y'all together, man. So, Need I, that. so what, what's the feedback on the record? What the streets talking about? How's it been going, man? Um, I love Mr. Hyde. I feel like people love Mr. Hyde. Um, this is... And it sound backwards. This is the first time I actually released a single and a video at the same time. Mm. Usually I do the the single, then the video or whatever. I just want to like play it by ear, try something different. So to get back to what you said, like yeah. it's hard tracking the numbers, the streams, they still mm-hmm. under 10,000, which yeah. I don't press for it. It ain't like big money with the streams, but it's a good indicator of how a record's going to yeah. do. Yeah. Ultimately, I'm going to use my gut if mm-hmm. I feel like it's one. Mm-hmm. But um, the video, like, the video Big did, bro, the video did like good. So we about at nine thousand. When I say that, that's not like running around. Let me, yo, my homeboy, go play this for me. Go push yeah. this and sitting up all night, like yeah. and knowing what it is. And I haven't like been out like yeah, yeah. about to do something. So yeah. this is my like my like taste tester. So yeah. overall, I'm I'm thankful to try some different avenues like mm-hmm. the YouTube ads, the actual Spotify ads, the mm-hmm. you know the had the DJs, the who's who definitely, out here definitely. really playing it in the club. So yeah. really trying to push it different digitally but in the street like and still be on these streets yeah 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 man so we gotta we gotta go through that mr high record first and foremost let's man. do it man before, crazy. before we even do that though he, i mean he talking real light so it's under ten thousand. i mean yeah, you yeah. still like six thousand though yeah, yeah. you know what i'm saying a lot of people yeah, ain't yeah, getting yeah, it i appreciate yeah. it man well, organically yeah and so we don't got no uh screaming farms right <laughs> and that's and that's scary too let me just say that like <laughs> to artists because like you're tempted because everybody know how to talk to talk now organic streams this that and yeah, the third yeah, you yeah. still got to look into what it is it isn't mm. and it got so confusing that's why I said like whatever the industry doing I know I'm going to put my yeah. dollars to the side and try to move like that with this, yeah, with yeah. the Spotify ads the Google ads the YouTube yeah, ads yeah, and yeah. you know really tap into some marketing agents oh, like yeah, definitely, all definitely, that definitely, shit definitely. like gonna yeah. spin your bag man you moving definitely. man so we got the first thing I want to talk about is the artwork bro like you know the artwork is next level. You know, it <laughs> seems like these days people just being that there's no physical CDs no more, there's no packaging. Artists just put any kind of artwork together. They might take a picture in front of a car, that's the artwork, whatever. Bro. They got nothing to do with the song, nothing. Nothing. So who did the artwork? What's the science behind the artwork, bro? The artwork is crazy, man. I appreciate that. And honestly, 
I'm proud of myself on this one because I've been there. Ain't been as bad. Like I see, take yeah. a picture. The letters don't look. The letters look like they're completely different yeah, from the. Yeah, yeah. Like so, honestly, like I tell people, Fiverr.com. This rap shit get expensive, but it's some mm. people that do some special things Fiverr for for oh, a special price. Man. But like I'm real anal with anything I do. So yeah, like yeah, yeah. going to Fiverr, that's like going to Marshalls. I really yeah. go through the racks yeah, and look yeah, at their artwork, yeah, yeah. and I usually go there to get inspiration. So long story short, like. Mr. Hyde, it was like um, when I seen like a, a different example with like a mask or they could yeah. do shit with the face. It was like Mr. Hyde that's giving a different yeah, side yeah, yeah. of me. So I'm pulling this layer or this this mask off like, you know, mm. the all is well bigs, this, that, and the third. And just um, mm -hmm. that's where the cover came from. Yeah. And it just turned out dope and the perfect representation of exactly yeah. what I wanted wanted it to to do. Yeah, that's going hard. Yeah, man. I like that. yeah. So who, who produced the record? Um, Epic the Dime, man. Big shout, Big Epic, shout the Dime. Epic the Dime. Y'all, y'all locked in before. That was your first one. Y'all locked in with. No, listen, and it's not even like I'm gonna keep it a hundred. Like I give game all the time. Like I didn't have nobody to help as far as beats when I want to get back to it. And even mm. what we saw my earlier, yeah. that's where we first fell off. Cause mm. when it was my turn to get back, like mm. niggas ain't know nothing. I done spent my last on this, but mm. um. Where was we at, man? Cause see, yeah, I don't, yeah. <laughs> bro, I don't want to talk my about man, that nigga, man, but I don't want to talk nah, about we, that nigga. No, hey, the, who produced the record? How y'all connected? All right, so Epic to Die. All right, yeah. so <laughs> beat stars, sound clip, this, then yeah. the third, and just okay. going through. Like I literally go with, we'll go through like ten thousand plus beats, like Ooh. going through for a project yeah, yeah, that you yeah, hear yeah, yeah. seven, ten songs, just to get make sure the quality is right, yeah. and just to make sure it's a dope record to hit in the first couple of seconds, and and thirdly, like. If it fit me. And yeah, if it don't, yeah, I throw yeah. it to somebody else. But um yeah, yeah. you got definitely gotta fit sonically. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, epic, yeah. Yeah. But Epic the Don, he's like, he got crazy, crazy credits, crazy beats. Yeah. Never met him, never had a conversation. He ignored every email I send it <laughs> and record I send. <laughs> Big shot epic the but Don, man. He's a he's ball, a goat man. in this shit and he moved yeah. his way and I respect it. Like yeah, yeah. yeah. About that's, business. that's what's up, man. That's what's up, man. Why, why did you decide to drop so early this this time around? I missed it, bro. Like, okay. like, and, and even I, I threw some records out there, everybody, and and good pussy string that they still do, you yeah, know, yeah, doing yeah, what they yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. But it was like, you know, to say I have it all, mm -hmm. like, like all in or whatever. Mm -hmm. Like I, I, I didn't, so I missed it. And it's like me, it's like a ticking time bomb. Like, bro, when it's time to create, it's time to create. It's yeah, time to yeah. get back to it. And so I ain't really look at. I do look at the quarters as far as. When this is gonna hit, that's gonna hit. Like how it's gonna affect yeah, things. Yeah, but yeah. I, with this creative shit, and that's the dopest thing about being independent. I can move when I want to move. Right, right, you know right, what I'm saying? Right. So that's luxury, right there, man. So and aside from that, just getting some things like the Guardy Stars, creating a good foundation, making sure the mm, businesses and right, little, right, you know, right, like man, really yeah, help, yeah. help the LLCs and yeah, yeah, yeah. your your accounting and having big business accounts and shit, and like the modeling shit. Just creating strong foundations so I can do what I do with this, right. and already have like a system and structure with that because. They they all my babies, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, so right. so so early I needed to, I couldn't help it. I'm ready and I'm excited, bro. Like I'm man, excited. This joint got so much legs to grow, man. We rocking with you. We're gonna keep pushing yeah. the joint through the spring, the summer, the fall. We're gonna get this joint it. up out of there, man, for sure, for it's sure. A it's, it's only, it's only, <laughs> yeah, it's one. It's and it's only the beginning, man. So we we, we gotta talk about the video, man, because the video is like I said, I'm not I'm not downing no artists. Mm. You know, there's nothing wrong with a running gun video. In the trap house or in front of a foreign, uh, Get you know, we, we can do that for certain <laughs> records. Get em. But I'm talking about a real treatment. I'm talking about real, a real written, you know, thought out video. That's what my brother got right here, man. So let's talk about, you know, why did you, you know, have the inspiration to make sure the video was a certain way and who directed it, who wrote the treatment for that joint? See, I'm going to show my love. Big salute to Radical Shooter. Mm. Um, I worked with him on a lot of projects. And yeah. honestly, I might have one video that didn't do like well, yeah, like yeah, above yeah. above the others. Um, let me just get like quick history to this. Like Radical Shooter. Ahead, I used to watch him. And he shot a lot of um, alternative artists. Yeah. Mm. Like a lot of rock and roll and pop and this, that, and the third. Every now and then he would do like, 
the rap videos, it wasn't that much, but I seen like they didn't know what to do with him. He was just super creative. So like we have a chemistry and a relationship because I've probably been building with him for like, like four years now. I'm still grandfathered in on the price. Fuck y'all. Y'all got to pay the up, <laughs> the up price. <laughs> but I re- at this point, I might have some ideas and I told him it's like dark and even though it's like a street record, just at face value, mm-hmm. I always wanted to have kind of like Show my weirdness, creepiness, something that's like, it's going to stop you. And the, the dopest things about the Radical Shooter video, because it's like an abstract storyline. It's kind of like... It's crazy, man. 20 different people can watch and get 20 different yeah. things. And I don't even know how you intentionally do that, but it's he's I able never, to do it every time. i never seen nothing like it, especially from an indie artist, especially from somebody who I know. <laughs> you know, I, I watch I watch videos all the time. I, I, I judge a lot of stuff off the people we know. Also, yeah, I, like, yeah. I mean, artists come through all the time. We watch videos all the time. I've been on video shoots all the time. It seems like it'd be the same thing all the time. Like most artists, when I've been on shoots, the, the videographer get there, they don't even know what they what about they to go, do. Yeah, they just make up something. Mm-hmm. All right, we're gonna go to this, this pool hall right here, mm-hmm. and, and, and we're gonna do a scene there. And then my homeboy, got, we got the trap. We're gonna go over there. And that's the video. That's it. So for you to minute. for y'all to sit down and really, you know, put together that I really hope that people see it and appreciate it and really understand and, and take the, art, the artistry. <laughs> and, and take high to uh, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and take you know, the artistry of it, man. Right and, and, and uh like I said, the record got a lot of more room to grow, but I just want I don't I, I don't want that to go over people's head. That that video is next level. But I'm definitely, a, I'm, I'm a video guy. Like, Little Chris is one of my dogs. Yeah. That's my yeah, top dog. What kind of, I ain't trying to get in your business, you know, but what kind of budget for a video like that, bro? Oh, don't let me mess up. I told you I get the old price <laughs> before they were shopping then. with them. Yo, yo, yo. That, that video is different. Yeah. The edit, like, the editing I, is different. I, I say, I, yeah. And it's supposed to have that gritty, like, tight grime. It's, it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's yeah. he understood, like, he understand me and I understand him. I'm kind of like a weirdo. And, like, radical is definitely that. He might have purple, green hair. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, and that's, like, young me, big salute to him. Like, he's caught a lot of traction in, like, Columbia doing what he's doing and doing some things. Like, they all show love. Mm-hmm. But, um, like, even, even, even when it comes to that, like, videos, I talk down on it because it's so, like, I downplay it because it's so, like, natural for me at this point. Mm-hmm. But when I'm about to do a video, I'm probably on the phone every other day with him. I'm sitting in with this idea. I'm mm. sitting in like, I'm going to wear this. So, you know what I'm like saying? That. Throw this into that. Or what, and he's like, yo, I'm thinking about I'm going to have you jump off some shit this time. For real? Mm-hmm. That's yeah. going to be cool. Like, yeah, so yeah, yeah. it ain't none of that get in there. And this is what we going to do. Yeah, yeah, I did yeah. that one time. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. tell you what it is real quick. Yeah. Check video. Yeah, okay, mm. okay, okay. And it looked like that and it came out like that. Ain't mad at it. Still a, it's still a dope yeah. video, but yeah. it didn't pull off from me that it was and that's yeah. what happens when you do and it's, it's yeah, just I mean yeah, these so days you know people they, they hear with their eyes especially the kids so absolutely you can't yeah. afford to Mm-mm. not put your all into the video you just can't you know you, the record might be crazy the video might be all you need to take it over the top mm-hmm. but if you you know take the shortcut or a cheap route or just don't put a lot mm-hmm. of thought into the video that's that's it that these days at this point it's hurting the record so Sure. I appreciate you, you for doing that, that, man. Uh, that understand the assignment. You yeah, feel me? yeah, like, definitely understand the assignment. Man. He ain't lazy. Big shout to him, man, for sure. And I'm gonna add this in too. Let me also say with Chet because as an indie artist, it's hard as fuck. I, that's why I always try to be transparent. Mm. Like I threw that record, picked that record, did it because it's a beat produced by Spaz out. Mm-hmm. Like he got some credits, Billboard charted before, and I actually do have a relationship with him. And the last time we ran a record, he was like, "Yo, I actually pushed the artist. I believe this, that, and the third. We got in TakeItSerious.com, um, DJ Absolute on the mm. series. He gave it like yeah, a plug. Yeah. I end up in different shit, so I'm thinking we gonna do this run. I did this record right. with him. I got lazy with my shit. I did have some different mm. shit, but I'm be honest. I got lazy with my yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. I just put my little money yeah, up, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then that like. If ain't nobody gonna pick it up, they ain't gonna pick it up. His name is his name, but it got to still be that. So, Mr. Hyde, man, Mr. Hyde. So, the record's going crazy right now. Any performances going down? What, what What's the next move for the record? I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> like, just on the promotion, and I mean, the, like, the, the promotion and shows of it. Yeah. Like, I'm really trying to make sense of it. Like, I, I'm, I'm gonna have to travel. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, I really yeah. want to, and I enjoy working in my yeah. city. Yeah. But to be kind, um, other than like the symposiums, the yeah, quarterly yeah, things yeah, that you do where yeah. you had a 
the big wigs and the high ups there. It's like, oh, yeah. it's a lot of things that just become kind of redundant. Mm. And I've been in that cycle. This ain't shooting nobody mm. down. But so the showcases, you ain't with the showcases, is that what you're saying? Let's talk about it. Ooh. So here's my thing. How you feel about the showcases, man? And that's why I really feel, feel back because I feel like it's people, a lot of people that, they always were ex-singers, ex-rappers. Now they do these shows, which is nothing wrong to showcase yeah. talent, but yeah. who are you showcasing it for? Yeah. So if I go to this show and now you charge me, so yeah. and it's not nothing that gets paying because everything costs. Yeah. But if right. I'm paying $25, $35 to come to a show and I'm performing in front of just mm. the same 10 artists every time that yeah. I go yeah. and we're all artists, yeah. like yeah. how much is that going to elevate my career? Now if yeah. you bring a DJ, yeah. if you bring a DJ effect, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Oh, or, or something you see what I'm saying? Like, bro, we- I got a, I got a new model I'm about to re- put out, and I'm gonna talk to you off camera about it because I can't tell the world yet. Yeah, man. But I got it's a new I got a new showcase model I'm about to come out with that's gonna be lucrative for everybody. So y'all stay tuned. Y'all heard it first. You already know what it is. We the trafficking DJ DJ Bezo, the whole team. We, we got something coming, and I'm I'm gonna I'm fill my brother. I'm gonna fill my brother in on that. Um, I want I want to you know because you know you one of those guys, man. I've seen you perform and. I feel like once you get out there and start performing the record, because I mean, having it on the streaming platforms, yeah, DJs playing in the club, um, you know, the video is crazy. But when you start performing that joint, because your performances is crazy, man. Uh, where, 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 where does the energy come from? Because you know, we see rappers, you know, from the the big ones to the small ones. I can understand the big ones because the crowd know the song word right, for word. Right, yeah. right. But even the small ones, <laughs> even the, I ain't gonna say small, even the indie, the the, the people that still trying to come up, they, they, they try, try to emulate them. Yeah, but they try it. it's like they just be on stage like this, walking back and forth. And I'm like, bro, these people came to see you perform. If you're trying to get your record, they have some motion. You need to find a way to have a good show to win them over. Like I said, I can see the artists that got a number one song and the whole crowd rapping the song. It's different. Yeah, you can just stand there. But even them <laughs> should put on a show because we paid to come see you. It's levels to this. So, shit. so do you do you do you do you practice your show? Where does all the energy come from? Is that just naturally you? Uh, you know, talk to the people real quick. The energy is just naturally me. Um, through time, I just learned to structure it as much as I can and when I say that yeah. you ask do I practice yes I practice mm, I don't run the like show that. a minimum of less than three to five times this is after getting the audio the, the show tape or whatever like correct mm, show like, tape even, even like you know it would be little shits like I'm throwing game out there tape. like when I do my live from the booth tap in if you watching this you haven't watched that shit cause I'm gonna do what hey, I do the in that shit like live I do from that the booth, man. but um even like having a little glass breaking of this they don't understand like as yeah. an artist yeah. like that has so much impact on yeah, transition, yeah, energy, this, that, and yeah, the third. Yeah. So I record myself at least three times performing it once I have the audio right. Mm. And that once for the endurance, make sure my air and everything is right. Mm. See what look crazy, see what oh, don't yeah. look crazy. So after seeing it three times, I can kind of pick a which which lane of me I want to stay on, yeah. which song, and uh, be mindful as possible when man, I perform. Man, three, man, that's a lot, man. They, they, I mean, they watch even a lot. You care about the art. I Not mean, it's, 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 nah, it's, it's a lot like because... That, we go to showcases all the time. We go to see artists open up all the time. Yeah. And you could tell they don't even know the song. Niggas yeah. be perf- I see niggas performing in the parking lot, like practicing in the parking lot. They don't even know their song. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so for this man to say, I listen to my show CD, my, my show mix three times, that's just next level. I, I mean, mean, performing I mean, it's in front sad of the to say, but I, I've, I've seen this so much where artists... I'm DJing. I don't DJ for showcases. And I and one thing I'll do is I'll while they rapping, I'll take the music out. Mm. See what, I'll be messing with them. And look, they don't even know their own, they don't even know their own song, bro. And that's a that's a real come up. That's a, that's a come up as a performer if you on your shit. Yeah. Them little if I drops take that music that? out and you still digging in that joint. Dang. Man, listen. It's, me, I, I like and I don't see it yet, but I like Sound check. You need to have a sound check. Don't have them no more. Nah, a lot of places. Nah, they just run it. Just go to it. Places. And yeah. see, a lot. I've seen. I mean, I've been doing this music thing for a minute, and I've seen artists, indie artists, bring their own mics to certain venues. Mm, I get yeah. it. If though. they ain't like the mics, I got my own. And I've seen artists that got a buzz. They won't even perform. That sound ain't right. You know. So yeah, sound. I think it's right. just certain things that. 
you got to care about as an artist, man. And 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 when I look at you as an artist, it seems like you you on that. You know, you care about the art from from the studio to the to the artwork. I respect that. How it's being put out to the performance. It's just different. And uh, I, I just want to say we appreciate that, man, because a lot of artists don't, you know, they, they just out here just running and gunning. And that's why you're not going to go nowhere necessarily because you got to have some direction. You got to have, you know, you got to care about the art you're putting out. You, you want us to work. buy this? You want us to buy yeah. into the brand? And you got to care about the work. That's that's you, that's the right word. That's integrity, integrity man. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Yeah, man. So I appreciate Definitely. that, man. Where, where does that come from for you, though? You know, um, the, I don't. You know yeah. what? Like, even in the, even in the Mister Hyde song, when I say like it's different layers, yeah, it's like I have a lot of I have a lot of in well I have a lot of energy in in general. Like I tell people, mm-hmm. like I literally literally take pop a blue pill every morning. Like mm-hmm. I ain't all the yeah. way like right, right. So at yeah. the end of the day, like who people see now, how mm-hmm. I speak, how I move, like taking time to think versus yeah. react, um. It was learned. It took a lot of breaking mm, me. Yeah, 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 yeah. And even though I've always had that energy, I think it's the one like when I'm performing, that's the one time it's free or this music. It's in a safe environment versus me taking mm. that part of me and running out in the streets with my yeah, integrity yeah, and yeah, loyalty yeah, and yeah. that. Because right. listen, we go, listen, you see what I'm saying? It's just I like long, when people tell you to channel your energy, this, that, and the third. So it's like that's that one place where. I can just get it all out like right then. I think it'd be bubbling until mm. I can get there. Like now I have to to perform. Yeah, like yeah. I have to perform sometime soon. So so you know, Mr. High Record, I, 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 I really wanted to I don't need him, but you, you <laughs> have to cool, have him. Mac. I was so, cool. <laughs> so I mean we you know, we we I wanted to really zero in on that Mr. High record. That record's priority right now. So we you know we didn't talk about that and we might revisit it again. So I appreciate, you know, everybody keep running that joint up. Mr. High is out that, right now. Watch Stream the video. That, watch the video. All that. Right. Music trapping DJ. We definitely behind the record. Um, but let's take it back a little bit I ain't gonna lie. I real he, quick. I he was about to get real deep on us. You know what I'm saying? Nah, Got nah. my integrity from my ancestors. <laughs> nah, nah, <laughs> but nah. you know it can go like that. I'm yeah. trying to be oh, mindful. Oh, yeah. I'm, I can, I'm a tangent. Yeah, so, <laughs> I, I, so I, I want to take it back real quick because, uh, you know, to me, when you first came on the scene, far as far I've known yeah. you, you was putting a lot of projects out. Um, to mm-hmm. my knowledge, you got four. Full length projects. Um, Gotti's World, the Key District, 2018, 2020 Karma, 2021. I love with the Goddess relationship, 20, mm-hmm. 2021 again, Big Energy. So, why did you kind of, well, what's the question? The question is, you kind of went to like a single model here lately mm-hmm. instead of a project. It, 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 was that just something you consciously thought about? You know, I'm going I'm to just throw these singles out there instead of putting on a project, you know? Honestly, it was more more or less of keeping music out there. I didn't switch the model, mm. but I didn't want to not deliver something. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, okay. How, yeah. do you, how do you know when it's project time? Bro, it just the, the record feel different yeah, to yeah, me. Yeah, okay, gotcha, gotcha. The, the gotcha. record feel different to me. Like everybody is cool. Like yeah. good pussy is good. Like in every move I make is something behind it. Like the dude was from Israel and the producer I had met him at like a yeah. mixer in Hollywood. Uh, so I'm like, okay. let me see if this could, you know, do yeah, something, yeah, move yeah, over yeah, here. Yeah. Everybody. Mm. I sold the t shirts with it. That uh, shit helped me say, you yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, gotcha. And also it still keep my algorithm moving in Spotify. Mm-hmm, facts. So while I, cause like I, we talked through the summer, cause I had we had changed some dates, like yeah. between the car and then, bro. I, yeah. Anywho, man, yeah. it was a lot that prevented a lot this summer. So just trying to figure out how to build these business, these two different businesses, put the energy in it, get the personal straight, mm-hmm. um, so I can get back in motion and moving around, bro. It was just keeping it out there, but the model has not changed. I okay. want to let okay. something go at least. Once a year. Mm, so, like, so we got a project coming? What are we talking about? That's what we talking about. Mr. Mm. High is the first single to it. I'm excited. Okay, yeah. so that's a, okay. So I'm excited, and, and, bro. You got a name for the project? You can leak that real quick. Big Motion Podcast exclusive. <sighs> okay. I think like what I'm leaning on, but it may change because of direction. Yeah. But I'm just thinking about calling it sheesh. Like, oh, oh it ain't going nowhere. That's it. That's and, it, bro. And, and that's let, it, let me bro. let me say why. Because Hashtag that. Even even I talk, it's just gonna be sheets because 
I'm not going to say like the higher ups, oh, they watching this, then the third, somebody took it and ran, but I do believe things catch and one person said, yeah, another person yeah, said, yeah, yeah, but like yeah. I have records to 2016 when I started saying it like that, yeah. like the little kids. You got you to capture that, bro. So it's Look like, it's like me, I wasn't on my business shit, I ain't trademark it, copyright or anything mm-hmm. like that. So I just at least want to let, just let y'all know a little bit, bring attention around mm. it so we can get a little bit of ownership and respect for that. <laughs> I think that's a good idea, man. Mm-hmm. I think you need to do that, bro, for sure, for sure, for Especially sure. Especially after big energy because yeah. it's a feeling when you say big energy. That's why yeah, I, yeah. I that type like picked up even in the world when people say big yeah, energy. Yeah. Um, matter of fact, a lady from the UK had gave me that that name. Mm. Um, but it's just something that, you know, on that end that I just talked about and then it's like, it's energy with that shit. It's right. just... 2018. That's where we're going. So, so out of all your albums, you know, all your projects, man, which one is your favorite joint? Man, that's a completely unfair question. I uh, love the fuck out of me. <laughs> <laughs> you got if you had to, if you had to pick um, one, if you had to pick one, I, I put like this. I put like this right here. Well, no, answer that first. I got another question for you. My favorite, my favorite album is Karma. Mm. My favorite album is Karma. Um. How so? How so? Talk to the people. Karma is more the the artist that I, I feel like I naturally am. Okay. And when I say that, it's just a lot of um I just say like in respect to the to the kings and the guys of the game, but just like even from the past and even not saying so much now, but the the Kendrick Lamar that are like, you ain't the type of listen that you, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That we just gonna throw on for this, that, and the third. Like, you gotta really listen. Like, mm-hmm. big up, appreciate y'all. Yeah, like, yeah, love yeah. y'all. Like, yeah. you really got balls, you got to go back. Yeah, yeah. And that's one thing I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna shake on. Um, but just I like, I like being honest, I like being transparent about me. Got, mm. you know, records. It's just, it's it's honesty, and I love soul music. Mm. Um, just always. And at that point in time, it won't most the most popular. So I had yeah. to throw in the right. money whispers or the yeah, shit that yeah, I can go yeah, perform, yeah, yeah. and then hope you like push come to shove. Mm. But as far as records, they're like, they're like the core of me. Like they just karma, like karma, and yeah. karma is called that because people is fucked up in this game. My thing was like, I ain't even gonna come at nobody sideways. Ain't put my energy to that. I'm put my energy in the ground. Whatever I get or comes from karma. That's their karma. Mm, and, um, fact. you know, Money Whisper, yeah, that did yeah. something great for me doing shows and moving yeah, around. Yeah. And my most powerful thing has never been, like, money. It's been the networking circle that, yeah, yeah, yeah. like, I've been allotted through certain situations. Yeah, yeah. All right. yeah. I got to ask you this question right here, man. We're asking all the artists this right here. If nobody ever heard of you, which we know, you know the masses has heard of you already, but for the person that never heard of you, I never heard of you. I'm just now seeing you on Big Motion Podcast or whatever it could be. I want to. I want you to give me five songs that's going to make me a fan forever out of your catalog. Five songs. If I never heard none I'ma of your just, music, I just... I'm going to just throw Woo out there. Mm. Um, I'm going to throw Woo out there. Um, I'm going to use the cheat code. Woo, Money Whisperer, because mm. um, that's, that's a lot of me. And then... Um, other layers. I love push come to shove. Mm. Um, it's a song called Antisocial. Mm. Um, one more. Damn, and this will get hard. <laughs> um, they never heard of you. They want. They want. They want to listen. They want to see what it is. And after this, they're gonna be a fan for life. Damn, it's so hard. I'm put the pressure on you. Mm. <laughs> that's my problem. There's so many different layers to me. Yeah. Um. Like I can, they probably all like yeah. five different albums. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but if I had to pick another one that I just love, love, um, fuck it, that I love, it's called, it's called "Stop Looking at Me." Mm. Stop looking at me. Y'all, That's it's. All right, y'all make sure y'all go scream all them joints, man. If you ain't never heard no Gotti Biggs music, go scream all that, man. You gonna be a fan after you listen to them joints right there, man. For real. Facts, 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 man. I like to ask yeah. everybody that, man, because you know we're we're a new platform. We know about a year in at this point, and I know a lot of people are discovering artists through our platform. So a lot of times, you know, people got a million things going on. The world's moving fast, so I want people to be able to go listen to those those records you just named. And if you tired of listening to the same yeah. old songs all day long, check out some new shit. Man. Yeah, some man, real. check out some new. Oh, I like you it, know it might it might some of the joint might be old, but it's new to you, so. And those, those are the joints that he said, you listen to those, you're going to be a fan for life, man. Yeah. So, 
I definitely had that. I definitely appreciate appreciate you for asking that question, man. Uh, I gotta ask you this as well, man. Twenty twenty three is here, is rolling. We're going into the second quarter. Uh, if we if we fast forward to December thirty first, and we about to go into twenty four, man, what is something you want to look back on this year and feel like, man, I accomplished that. I did that. Um, I just really want to grow, groom one. I want to be a better businessman. Mm. I want to be a. I want to be a a better businessman. And what would let me know that? It's cool to have the the information, but the I want I want my day to day to be business. You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, like yeah, I, yeah. I still do it. My what I'm saying is time well spent. Me moving it, me knowing legislation and different things mm. that's going to benefit me, my yeah. companies, yeah. and just look back. Matter of fact, and so if, to make it easier to look at, even with the businesses that I'm working with, and I am part of my business on that, like mm. all of them just to be in 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 the in the green even the newer businesses gotcha. and the name to start means something like the these brands to be start look to 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 begin to be looked at as brand um right 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 and that's and that's and that's going to happen so, and, and, and and excuse me and to have the best fucking project that came out mm, in 2023 we waiting on it man we said name remember was I'm not playing sheesh there you go and I'm taking a that's big gamble that. on that's this official. bro I'm taking a big gamble but on it's this it's going to happen bro and and I like how you gonna. I think you need to stamp that. So that's why we gonna run. I'm glad you running with that. Name. I appreciate your insight. It make it man, easy. you so, gotta stamp that, bro. You gonna make a song called Sheesh? I got a song called Sheesh. You, got, you already got a song called Sheesh. <laughs> you gotta yeah. do a part two or something. Yeah, yeah, you gotta do a part two. Part two. No, no hook. It'll be crazy. And matter of mm. fact, Sheesh is a song like big salute to Millie McJagger. That song too. That yeah. they probably like if I ever perform and get Millie to come like. Yeah. I, we've never performed it and not oh, made that wow. shit shake. Like, no matter where we at, it be for me mugging at first. Yeah, <laughs> it's yeah, just one of them yeah, shit. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's you go love. Up. That's love. That's love, man. You go up on that one. So, so you know, as an artist, man, you know, like I said, you you, you, you really on top of your business. And like you said, you want to get better and better at it. And you mentioned your brands, man. A lot of artists, they just rap. They don't really do a whole lot else past that. So I definitely applaud you for that, man. So can you talk about... Yeah, other brands outside of, you know, you rapping? Yeah. Um, you know, kind of explain what they are so the people could know. Yeah, e- e- even even I, I start on the music side because a lot of people don't know this. Okay. Like, even people seeing me moving, like, why I only do one project a year, I really try to make sure everything makes sense. Like, mm. I have a distribution mm-hmm. deal with um, Southwest Digital. Okay, okay. Um, you know, it was connected through Empire Records yeah. and different things. So, like, I have certain artists right. that I distribute their music right now. Mm. It's a small percentage, but it's different things that I, I may do mm. for them. Didn't know that. I've had, <laughs> I've had like, um, invested in businesses and completely fucked my, fuck my money um, to different mm. situations. But, like, I had a business partner in Houston, big salute to Emperor Great. He the first one that got me on the money path. But, like, mm-hmm. radio stations that have, like, program directors, it's up there. You can just... It's it's a lot of different things. I always want to create jobs like for my people. Um, yeah. I've had a couple of artists, and I wouldn't even say they were my artists. My thing is, let me show you how to grind, how I grind. This ain't the fame route. Yeah, but this is right, for me yeah. to show you how to put some pennies and dollars in your pocket and move your brand and create different opportunities with it. Um, That's what it's about, right? Damn yeah, right. That's what it's about. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Um, definitely. so on that side, because my big one of my big goals, like Garden Media Group, at the end of the day, I do want to have like a music branch. It's, I just want to create something in the music industry that can kill that whole pimp relationship with like the artist. Mm. You see what I'm saying? The person that knows the business gets paid, and the other one they yeah. on the they on the dog leash for their whole life. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. It's enough money out here, and so I want to create a, a structured business organization like That'd be th- big, these man. talented rappers because everybody don't know. Yeah, they and it's don't. intended to be right. like yeah, that. They don't know, and it's a lot of talent. So I want to be able to help some people like they always have a big percentage of their royalties X Y Z like to really give them the game. not let me do this for you yeah. like teach them how to fish yeah but still have some contracts that's and big, place some percentages that's, that's going to bless me you know what I'm saying it yeah, still benefit yeah. me because it's a lot of time and yeah, that's big talk my name is Dan I like I like how you moving with that bro so it's been a, so long as I get to the end so <laughs> on the music side it's just been a lot of trial and error. A lot of invest, a lot of investing. Some has been beneficial, some hasn't. Um, 
Shoot, I did. I heard y'all shot big shoot, salute to um Gucci um Gucci Films. Like yeah, I got a yeah, movie yeah, with yeah. them. Get, get you one films out in Charleston. Yeah, like she yeah, yeah, she yeah. go hard. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I was I was you know doing some things on that, and that's just like a tip of the iceberg. But Gaudy Stars, like now you know. Let's yeah, talk about you, Gaudy you Stars. Gonna see me out there. It's um it's a clothing brand, but I didn't want to. Yeah. I wanted to be able to stand alone outside of music. Like I don't have this big mm-hmm. name. It's like uh. Shit, Rihanna. Anything she put out now, I'm not saying she don't earn it, but I know what it's not. I, I know where I'm at, yeah. and that's what helped yeah. me know how hard I got to work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, God of Stars, I got some shit like T-shirts, like they a little different, like the black on black. It look it look different, but just like one shirt said, I don't feel bad from everybody, and like kind of the jersey letter got sheesh and the logo on the back. Mm-hmm. It's kind of like taking simple and make it complicated. I got a shirt to say, this dick was made for stars and on the back say not for hood bunnies. <laughs> um, I got a new shirt. I call it the dope <laughs> tee. This shit say, I don't sell dope. So it's just like yeah, speaking yeah, out yeah, loud yeah, yeah. through fashion and not just, yeah. oh, I got a dope. I got a I got a dope saying. Let me put it out. No, yeah. let me make sure these colors not. Let me make yeah, sure yeah, this yeah, yeah, this yeah, printed. Yeah. Let me make sure I can wash it ten times and it still look the same. Yeah, yeah. And then then just merging over right now over into like because that's the sheesh line. It's more like yeah. blunt in your face. Yeah. But then mm-hmm. like this just regular gaudy stars like this this on like I'm gonna wear it with the red bottoms because that's how the fuck I feel about mm-hmm. it. You know what I'm saying? Um. So it's just some like and I like yeah. where it's going. I spend nights. Designing and yeah, click yeah, clacking yeah, and yeah, X Y yeah, Z, yeah. but right now we're doing the twenty dollar sheesh t shirts t okay. sale. So any t any and every t shirt on the site um is is twenty dollars. Um, it's no shipping on the site. I'm running it through That's all all, all, all March right now. Plug um, the site. Plug the site. Gaudystars.com. We doing okay. business correct, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> facts, uh, facts, 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 facts. You can purchase your domain. Log on. <laughs> Log on. Put and, your uh, order in. No shipping. Definitely. And, but I, no let me shipping fees. Check that shit out because I didn't do anything overnight. Like, even when I wasn't on the road to performing, like, I was spending nights and nights and nights. Like, I need 20 different pieces mm, before I even yeah. just revamp and put this out type yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. So, doing that and then that Gaudy Stars. I love it. I'm proud of it. And then gorgeous monsters. This I'm calling it modeling the art. I don't want it to be like a modeling agent where it's just yeah, booking. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm just really trying to make like my world and modeling world like mesh. Like mm-hmm. it, it's so it has a great foundation. We restructuring, like you say, behind the scenes. I've had I've 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 had two females this far so far. I've invested in them. Mm. We done did shoots. Um. Take it on time and money, and the shit didn't work out, mm. or I don't. You know what I'm saying? Like it's keep different. Going. You gotta keep going. Different contracts. So it's like people see the music, they see the records, like what he's doing. But I've never stopped moving. So the gorgeous monsters, but um, you know the the co CEO, um, Australia. She's like super dope at what the fuck she does, and everybody, you know people watch me, man. Y'all know yeah. that my boot thing thing. Yeah. All my little yeah yeah. I know what yeah. the, the new niggas say, but like she's dope at it, and I feel like it's always been worth the investment and what she puts into it. Like we just shot last week. Like people don't know like the the money it costs and the, the time oh, yeah. and the, like looking oh, yeah. through it and oh, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. just trying to take it move like I did with this music shit. Present it, brand it well enough where you can. Get attention by quality people that can move your career up. Definitely, um, definitely. I think it's all going to work together, man. From the modeling it to, is. The, to the fashion, it to the is. Music. All, it's all the music. I think it's all. That's why I love. That's why I wanted you to talk about that because, it is. like I said, you know, and, and nothing's wrong with just wanting to rap, but uh-uh. you know, I think at this point, man, when you independent, you, you wanna all. you wanna do it all. You gotta you gotta have merch. You gotta you know whatever you could do, but don't just depend on just the rap because. You can get some other things moving before the rap start moving, you know. And you be able to invest into the rap through that. So Facts. definitely wanted to big it up, big it up, and get you to talk about it for the people, man. Let me, let me, let me ask you this: Can you name more than three rappers that you could say really have money and don't have anything on the side going? Like when you think of money, like Rick Ross or they, like you said, I can't I mean, name it's, none. It's that's, so many different. You know, ventures. All, all of them got you know stuff yeah, we know about, stuff we don't know about. That's why I said you know it's 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 interesting because you still in the come up, but you got so much other things moving at the same time. Whereas you you see other artists that's on the come up or whatever, they just rapping. They ain't got no merch. They not trying to do nothing. You know, it's like. You gotta have something else going on because something else you can get the merch moving before the, 
if the merch is dope, you get that moving before the rap could get moving like you want. So yep. I just thought that we, we 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 had to highlight that for people that's looking on, artists that looking on, not only for artists that looking on, but for people to know they can shop with you and support you in that way as I well. It. And on top of screaming the music. So I just think it's very, you know, honorable of you and and, and, and like I said, you just care about the art, man, and, and the business of it. And, and, and Tampa, yeah, man. and, and it just real. I just had yeah, to highlight that because it. You just don't see it, man. You know, we got a million rappers. All they want to do is rap, 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 rap. They won't yeah, do nothing of, else outside of rap. A lot of, <laughs> a, lot, a lot of them can barely do that. Yeah, yeah. Well, I ain't another story. I'm just saying, <laughs> barely can do that. But he's telling you, I ain't never heard this man lie. I come close to it. <laughs> saying, barely can do that. We done had a lot of conversations. I'm just hey. Yeah, so, man, we got my man Gotti Biggs here right now, man. The record is out, Mr. High. Mr. High. Sheesh. And you know we got yeah. that new album on the way. You saying the name will be Sheesh. I think we're going to stick with that. We're going to yeah. run with that. Plug your social media real it's, quick, it's man. It's a problem. It's a problem. Gaudy Big, G-A-U-D-Y-B-I-G-G-S. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm on TikTok. Yeah, I'm yeah. on Instagram. It's all the same. G A. U D Y B I G G S. Like I said, we doing business. Oh yeah, <laughs> facts, facts, facts. YouTube, facts. they added some numbers, but it's still Gaudy Biggs. It'll come yeah, up. G A U D Y B I G G S. Um, the website G G A U D Y B I G G S. Um, I have it .org now, but I'm about to my uh, other domain name that I had with somebody another company is about to free up, so it's about to be GaudyBiggs.com again. Word, word, word. Um, That's big. Got yeah. his own website and all, man. Right. So y'all make sure y'all log on. Y'all EPKs. make sure y'all shot with him. Y'all make sure y'all scream that Mr. High record. And one thing I want y'all to do on these on these on these uh, digital platforms, not only listen to the record, like the record, love the record, add it to a playlist, and all follow, that. Follow 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 all, uh, follow, the artist, follow yeah, the yeah. artists on the platform. All that all of that helps the algorithm. We had an interesting conversation about algorithm for the show. So add to a playlist. It sounds crazy saying that now, but all of it helps. It really does help. So love the record, like the record, share it, tell somebody about it, add it to your playlist. All of that helps. Don't just listen to the music. But, you know, even if you just do that, we appreciate you. Bobby. If you want to go the extra mile, do all those things I just said. Love it, like it, add it to the playlist, share it somewhere. It all helps the record get the moving, man. So scream that Mr. High record everywhere you find music. Go to YouTube, watch the video. The video is amazing. And log on to GottyStars.com and get some of that merch, man. Gotti Biggs in the <laughs> building. He's an official Big Motion All Star. I appreciate. I like that, man. I am. <laughs> I, had, I, had, I, had, I had to think of something, man. <laughs> so, hey, you got any shout outs before we get up out of here, bro? Um, big love to everybody that loves me, and big love to everybody that can't stand me because you, you, what you see is what y'all allow me mm. and motivate me to do. Like, I don't even want to be cliche, but like, yeah. I get up every day. As soon as my eye open like this, I want to win and whoop a nigga ass in life. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. I'm going to prove facts. everybody wrong. So, that's the most genuine I can be. Big salute and word, love to everybody word. that loves me. You know that. Yes, Gotti Biggs in the building. This is one of my favorite artists right here, man. I appreciate Mr. it. Mr. Hot out here. everywhere. He mean that shit. I go by the name of Bezo Bezo <laughs> 803, all that social media. I got my codes with me right now. Being Mikey Doll sound Mikey, man. Exclusive Solid interview, man. Neck. DJ Effect on the camera. <laughs> we out, y'all. Big Motion Podcast. We catch y'all next Music time. Music trafficking DJs, Nick. You know that. Shit. <laughs>